What's up mga pusang galaw? Welcome back to another video of Comic Raf. Today, 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 we're actually going to search what is the real meaning of kink. What is kink? Also, we have a chat here because this is actually live on Twitch. Say hi guys. Hi hi. Hey hey. So what is kink? How does one get a kink? This video is just for that one because a lot of people know the meaning of king but no one and I mean no one knows how a king forms the different side of kinks I have here my trusty Google at the side here and we're actually going to be searching how does one get a king how does one form a king Chibi White stop that <laughs> let's find out in today's video <laughs> what is kink google i want you to hear how does one pronounce kink kink oh come on can you say it one more time baby kink kink is about in human sexuality kinkness is the use of non-conventional sexual practices concepts or fantasies oh, 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 oh. so basically kink is a concept that is about sexuality or the sexual act or the sexual practices since no nut november is done this is it for you my dudes to unleash hell all over the world it's unleashing time my dude it's unleashing time where does kink come from let's go in deeper 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 Oh, there we go. Who invented kinks? Not that kink. That's a band. Wait, there's a band named Kink? Oh no. <laughs> Where do kinks come from? Oh my god, what is this about? Chibi White. How you- <laughs> Stop! Where do kinks come from? It's complicated. It says, Bustle. Kink has made its way from back rooms, hidden dungeons, and worked its way into the mainstream in recent years. And while many long-term kinkster, so you're telling me, me, a friendster long-time user, is a kinkster. Is that what you're saying to me, Mr. Bustle here? Mr. Mr. Bustle right there? Is that what you're trying to say here? There's only one kink that I like, and that's the big bu- <laughs> Biggest issue is, where do kinks come from? How does one get a kink? There's a lot of questions that science does have not answered yet. The short answer is, no one is really sure. No one. No one is sure how does one get a kink? All right, guys, the video is over. I'm leaving. Bye bye. So that's it. So that's it, huh? Making this video is a mistake because no one is sure on where the hell kinks come from. No one. There's no one. There's no like science searches about. Who made kings? Apparently, because it's like a different topic. Oh, 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 talking about kings is a sin. I can't talk about this. Oh. Kinks, much like sexual orientation and gender identity, I created through a complex interplay that research doesn't fully understand of genetics, environment, and our experiences paired with sexual relevant context. Let's establish a working definition, says Boston. However, just like the questions of origins. Creeper, oh man. Creeper, oh yeah. Ooh. Defining kink is trickier than it seems at first. There are some sexual practices that are commonly put under the kink umbrella. Bondage, sadism, masosum, spanking, and role playing are all well-known types of kinks. My pee pee not hard anymore. <laughs> So if kinks are just different ways to enjoy sex, where do they come from? Up until fairly recently, this was fairly made at 2017, just a disclaimer. Being kinky was considered a mental disorder. In fact, kink was only removed from the Diagnostic and Statistical Manual of Mental Disorders. So what are you trying to say here is that being kinky is like being joker. All the kinks are sociopaths, so we're all insane. Basically it. <laughs> wow, what a quote. If you happen to if you happen to have a really great masturbation session session on a blue couch, then suddenly blue couches might start making a little hot and buttered. 
What a fucking quote. Uh, Dr. McDaniel says that one way to form kink is actually by creating a sexual connection where there wasn't one before. So let me get this straight. Let me get this straight. One forms a kink by actually doing something about it. So making a kink is man-made. All right, so apparently no girl can actually say that to me. Well, I'm sorry. I'm actually, I can actually go out to you there because I have this, this weird type of kink about having like a, you know, big on there, under the line there. But I'm sorry. Bruh, what the fuck? What do you mean? <laughs> Whenever you form a sexual connection into it. Sexual connection. Uh, let's just say I try to do it here. Blindfolded, I blindfolded myself. I can see anything. Oh, oh, oh. I can see anything. Oh. Oh. And then, if I happen to like, just you know, do the thingy. Well, I'm actually sitting in a good old chair here. And then I was like, oh, that was like the best one-on-one -on -one session that I have. Oh la la. I'm going to form a king. Is that what Dr. McDaniel says? What? 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 That's absurd. She also points out that our fear responses and our arousal responses are very similar. And that our bodies can always tell what's happening when we're turned on. Just like what I de demonstrated earlier. Because of our fear <laughs> and arousal responses, you're experiencing also a, an arousal response. Because someone is actually chasing you. And that someone is actually a motherfucking zombie. So you're meaning to say you're gonna have a kink that is actually based around onto the zombie and also being chased after? Is that what you're trying to say here? Mr. What's your name again? McDaniel? Is that what you're trying to say here? Hmm? Oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> it's so disturbing. Stop! So we don't know exactly where kinks come from. The simplest answer is that it varies from person to person. Some people might be able to trace their kink, while others might have no idea why getting spanked gets them going. But ultimately, it doesn't really matter, says Boston. Yes, is matter. So instead of worrying where a kink comes from, go out and enjoy. Because could we all use a little bit more fun in our lives? Um, uh, wow. So, here's what the thing that we learned today. Kink, we don't know the real origin about. That's uh, good to know. A lot. But how many kinks are there? Do you guys know? Do you guys know how many kinks are there? You. Do you know how many? Hmm? Can you guess how many? Let's search it up on Google. Because I don't know how many as well. From A to Z, 26 kinks and fetishes you should know about. Hmm, so this is just like one of the basic things or like the most common kinks known. 26 from A to Z. So a lot more kinks are being formed by the daily basis that we still don't know about. But all the more common ones are at 26 or more. That's actually big brain. A lot of things to know about. A lot of knowledge that I'm sharing to you guys. Hmm. Dang, you know, this is so cringe. <laughs> Oh my god, I can already see myself hating while I'm editing this shit. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed that video, enjoyed this uh, researching about things that we don't know about. And also, we <laughs> resident sleeper here, my folk. Okay, I'm, I'm actually boring, that's Chibi Whitey, that hurt my feelings. <laughs> If you actually want to enjoy or actually join this session of me actually recording live with a Twitch audience, feel free to go to my channel. It's twitch.tv slash comicograph. I'm also gonna be leaving it down there in the description. While I'm actually recording, you're gonna actually comment down, see, and be part of the video. <laughs> it's a really cool, fun idea that I just kind of like thought about like a few minutes ago because I kind of want to interact more with my Twitch audience, people who watch my Twitch channel. So. Feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel and feel free to visit my Twitch channel. I'll be linking it all down there, down below, on the description below. See you on to the next video. Bye-bye.